Hello and welcome to yet another art studio vlog. Today is Tuesday, August 10th. I spent the last couple of days packaging orders from the shop update. Thank you all so much for your support. If you checked out my shop and made a purchase, even just liked or favorited some of my items in my Etsy shop. I hope if you watched my last vlog, you enjoyed the process of that entire shop update. Yesterday on Monday, I finished packaging up probably 99% of the orders that I had gotten and I did a post office trip. So all of those orders are now in transit and will arrive at their destinations pretty soon I hope. As for this entire vlog, this will be the last vlog of my summer break. I'm thinking that we will get organized, organize my space, kind of get a clean slate for the start of the semester so everything can go smoothly. Speaking of the semester, also be preparing for my second year and for this fall semester in my animation illustration program. I've learned so much in just the first year so I'm super excited for the second year and ready to like kick the rest of this year's butt. I also got these pants. I will show you because I love them. I like them a lot. <laughs> Let's go. Today is Thursday, August 12th, and I've run into some issues with my silhouette and it makes me super sad because I got it in my last vlog, brand new, it's only a few weeks old, and it was working perfectly and I had no problems and I was loving it. In the last clip, I was like, oh, I'll do a cool time lapse of me finishing up all of these memo pads. All of a sudden, it is not reading the registration marks. So for what I do is I use the print then cut feature. So you have these registration marks that print on the page. So then the machine will read them. And then that's where it knows exactly where to start cutting around your designs. So all of a sudden, it would not read the registration marks. There's also an option on the silhouette for you to manually move the blade where it needs to be in a little box so then it could read the registration marks and even that was failing which I can't find anything on the internet of manually registering failing because all of the solutions for if it fails register then just use the manual registration. So um, that it, that is an issue and it's really strange because it kept failing, kept failing, manual registration not working and then it would work it would read it would cut perfectly and then i'd go to do the next sheet for uh, another cut and then it would fail again but i was getting really frustrated because i had like just gotten this machine and it was working perfectly and then all of a sudden it wasn't working and i was trying all of the fixes that are online i sent an email to support um that same night and i was super happy to get an email pretty quickly and I was following the instructions and it had a file that I could download and test. And it actually worked for three times in a row. All of the test ones, I did the first test, it worked. And then I was like, okay, well, I should just keep trying to make sure it's going to keep working. And then I did two more and it was successful again. I decided to go and do my own designs. Okay, it's working now. It's working. Something fixed it. And then it failed again. 
but it's okay because I was then able to actually take a video and show exactly what was going on when it was failing. Um, so I could send that to the support email. Looking at it from a different angle, a good thing that I could show exactly what was going on when it was not working. That's where I was at and I sent the email. I'm just gonna try to keep positive even though it super sucks that it's not working totally right now. I'm glad that I'm in contact with support and the most recent email that I received um, has some more instructions to maybe fix it. So um, I'm gonna follow those and see what happens. And if not, I'll email back, I'll update what's going on. And hopefully we can figure out something. It's Tuesday, August 17th. Today I've kind of just been sat here editing all of the footage I got thus far for this vlog and I'm all caught up and it is lunchtime so I'm about to have some lunch and finish watching studio vlog. So and then after that I want to dive into seeing what I can do for the silhouette because I haven't really touched it for a few days. I kind of just let it sit and not really stressed about it, so we'll see if it will work today um, and how long that lasts. And I want to do some drawing because it's been a good amount of time since I've done some drawing, so. In the last clip, I got a stand for my Cintiq because I learned one of my classes this semester. It is a painting class and it's going to be digital. But typically it's acrylic, but um, my professor decided to do digital and I'm super excited um, and we'll be using Photoshop. I will be using my Cintiq more. So I got the stand for it, and it's awesome, and I'm so glad I got it. <laughs> I also got one of those, those gloves. I'll show you. Those drawing tablet gloves. So basically, if you've never seen these before, they're quite strange. I think they're funny, but it basically helps. So when you're drawing, there's like less drag from your hand touching the screen. So I thought I should go ahead and pick one of those up since I will be... I know I will be spending a lot of time drawing and sitting at the desk. And then that was another reason why I got the stand too. The stand is super awesome and allows me to get it at a more comfortable angle to draw it. Super excited for this semester, which starts in two days and that's, it doesn't feel real to me. Anyway, I'm gonna eat lunch and then we'll see what else we do today.
Hello, it is August 19th. It is the first day of the fall semester and I have class in about an hour. So this fall semester, as of right now, the last semester that's going to be fully online. Yeah, I'm gonna take advantage of being home and not having to commute and then we'll see what happens for spring. But anyway, I am super nervous for the first day. Um, it's not so much first day of like school part. I've done that a lot of times. Like I've been co in college for a while now. It's more so the knowing that I'll have to get used to a new schedule and new routine. That like not knowing of how everything's going to be set up um, kind of stresses me out. Friday tomorrow is my birthday. So woo! I don't know what I'm going to do for my birthday. But I have it off. I don't have school. So I'm happy about that. Um, then the weekend and then the following week starting on Monday will be the first full week Monday through Thursday for me. As for yesterday, I did some studies getting kind of warmed up um, for like figure drawing and such. I feel quite rusty and slow so I'm gonna do some more practicing on my own time just so I can build up my my speed and confidence in putting down lines again <laughs> for studies. Then I went over to my dad's shop and helped him with a few things around his office and we also cleaned my car so my car is all sparkly and clean now. Let's see how the first day goes. Hello, it is Friday and it is my birthday. Woo, it's my 23rd birthday. Yeah, I don't have anything like totally planned for my birthday. I'm just gonna be having a dinner of my request and then we're also gonna have confetti cake cupcakes, but with no frosting because um, I honestly just like the cake part. <laughs> I don't really care for frosting that much. Confetti cake muffins. Um, but yeah, so yesterday was my first day of the fall semester and it went really well. I had two of my classes, like I, I think I mentioned it before, but I had a digital painting class and the second one was a figure drawing class. Yeah, I really like the professors. I can tell that I'm gonna learn a lot and have a good time this semester for so far for just those two classes because I haven't had my other ones yet. I do have some homework, so that's like on my to-do list today just to get it over with. This is going to be the last day of this vlog and then my next vlog will be the first official like full week of the semester um maybe i'll do like two week span i am super excited to be filming during the semester because obviously as you already know or maybe don't know last school year i did not film at all i want to continue documenting my experience in my program and all of the stuff i've learned and such so i think it'll be cool to look back on as well yeah so far so good i'm feeling pretty good today and I put on this shirt that I love. It has like 
puffy sleeves that kind of cinch at the end and I really like it. Um, but anyway, farewell until the next one. Oh.